Hello, welcome back to Blend Switch Live. Today I'll be doing some simple rigging. Uh, I was thinking Spider-Man, but then I'll think, okay, I'll just do Ultraman today, something different. Just a very simple Ultraman. So I downloaded Ultraman Cosmos. It's a low poly model. And yeah, there are all kind of Ultraman. And there's Ultraman Tiga, Ultraman Taro. You can download from Sketchfab. Most of them are free. I mean, the simple one, but you can also buy and purchase the more high resolution one and I'll be using Pupa Animate Pro instead of Mixamo because I want to just use my own add-on uh, the tools from Louis Art so it's cost $50 but still a pretty good value let's uh, let's see what this add-on can do okay Pupa Pupa Animate Pro and I'm using it with Blender 3.2.2 let's just import our Ultraman GLTF downloads Ultraman Cosmos. If you can't, if you can't see the model, it's probably too small or too big. View frame selected. Okay, it's definitely too small. This guy doesn't have any rig. Uh, it doesn't have any bones, so we can scale it hundred times. it's not even symmetrical that's probably not very good but I guess that's okay for now so I scale it 100 times compared to Susan head I think Susan has facing that way so maybe we should rotate this guy okay save Ultraman rig I think it's probably a good idea to actually make this guy symmetrical but let's try let's try okay this have okay the model is not the best model but Anyhow, let's let's uh, clear the parents and keep transformations and delete everything else. Ultraman. Yeah, I think I really need to make this symmetrical. Control A, apply all transform. Mirror this guy. Yeah, it's gonna be a little bit weird, but that's okay. Cool. We 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 just came out with the new Ultraman. Ultraman Blender Sushi. Okay. Let's see. This is the Pupa rig rigger. It okay, it requires to be inside a collection, so just move this into collections, new collections, call this Ultra Man. Ultraman and select our our collections create a new rig we have something that looks like Mixamo online with Mixamo you can quickly create the bones and oh, that's a good idea in the past if you want to do this manually uh, you can create your own joints and stuff nowadays you want everything fast so auto rig is definitely something you need to have semi automatic rig something that you can control a little bit and you need to have some kind of flexibility with pupa you can actually do rigging and animations and retargeting if you if you're doing like mo mocap motion capture Back in the days, we need to draw our own joints, make our own controllers, all the fancy stuff. Even today, it's a good idea to kind of know how to do it manually, just in case the auto rig failed. Let's see how good this 
Pupiron works for us. So yeah, basically the, this is just like Mixamo, I think we need to place where the head is, where the neck, position of the neck and yeah, just kind of guessing. It's probably where the chest should be. Yeah, I think that's about right. Preview. So we have the bones, skeleton, and we just need to, if we are happy, we just need to bind collections. Hopefully this works. Oh, okay. Okay, oh, oops, our character is like separated. Wow, we need to merge vertices by distance. But Blender should be smart enough to keep the rig in the bind. Okay, so that's basically um, how Pupa add-on works. Um, I haven't tested everything, but yeah. So we have the controller for animations ready. The by default the legs okay it's ik and we have this wrist controller we have ah the, not the wrist this is the root controller it's the waist so you can do like manual animations oh this guy is actually that's unusual okay just now I saw kind of IK. The arm is FK. No, this is, yeah, this is IK by default. Um, and then the, with Blender, normally we have this as well. Yeah, that's, that's for the finger. Ah, okay. This one's bending slightly incorrectly. Anyway, I want to make a thumb. Good job. So, yeah, of course, you can do the similar thing. You can use Mixamo, upload your model online, bring it back with Skeleton, and then use Mixamo add-on with Blender. But with this, you have your own uh, tool set. You don't need to upload it to Mixamo. Okay. This for I think for character like Ultraman or Spider-Man, the simplest superhero that everyone can simply, you know, like customize. I think Ultraman and Spider-Man and maybe Power Rangers, yeah. They they're like kind of like ultra the ultimate superhero. They are pretty universal. Anyone can dress up in full, like a diving suit or something, and become a superhero. Yeah, okay, this is Ultraman giving a pose. So that's a quick uh, look into Pupa Alon. Actually, I haven't finished. I know I can pose this character, right? I can animate it manually, but there's also, okay, there's this feature of Pupa add-on animations and retargeting. There's also extra reach utilities if the character have like a hat, things like that. But apparently we have all kind of pose and animations. Okay. Pretty cool. Uh, Try flare. How how does this work? Preview animation. Ah, okay. See, character anim is animated. Okay, that something. Okay, that, the thing with, for example, this this is incorrectly bound, 
and the character is uh, yeah it's not on the floor so we probably need to change the z this we might need to do some waiting i haven't checked on that okay z locations yeah this is always kind of tricky this is like a just like mixamo it's like motion capture animations so we have this how oh. anyway apply animations so we have that what if we want to add more we don't have let's see if I switch to Samba and then preview the animations seems to replace it okay anyway just replace the animations because I don't I don't like the first one mm -hmm. okay this is better this is long animation okay we can actually extend the animation so there's extend animation so if we want to suddenly switch from samba to another dance break dance we can preview the animations so it's gonna extend it so it switch <laughs> it switch to break dancing from samba and then we can apply the animations you can also apply animations only to selected bones so that's really handy feature of Pupa I guess that's why it's a it's a pro rigging tools because it, it does more than just rigging so I need to figure out how to fix this part I think yeah the waiting something is a bit off okay anyway I need to ask Luis retargeting this is also something that I'm interested in if we have two we have like a motion capture rig from Mixam or yeah we can transfer the rig I think or transfer the animations I need to figure that out I think this is retargeting for different type of rig and I like to be able to import my own animation as well that's my ex uh, expectations with this uh, poop iron but at least yeah we have our ultraman rig and animate it okay so hopefully you find that useful um yeah i will i will if i'll need to watch uh, some more videos of poopa animating animation pro um but other than that i'm pretty happy it's it's almost like mixamo but you have it as an add-on and you can you don't need internet in order for this to work so yeah hopefully you find this useful thanks again for tuning in and i'll see you next time thank you bye